Well, welcome back, everybody. So inside, we can smile. We have a very special guest with us today. Despite the various hurdles she has endured, upcoming artist Amanye is motivated to share her original sound and eclectic combination of dance hall and ama piano. I don't even know what yes. name so. Oh, and no. positive energy as well with the world. Hi, lady. How are you doing? Hello. I'm so good. It's good to see you. I'm so happy to be here. You look like a ball of positivity That's and good, good vibe ah. and abundance. Dance, oh, you know. God. So my name actually means the one that brings peace. Ooh. Amanie. So I like that you said that. Oh, I feel that. I yeah. feel that. I feel that. <laughs> no, I do. Seriously, but um, so music though, because I think many people thought you're gonna go into dancing straight. For sure. Because you're from Even a I family did. of dancers. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So for those who don't know, who's mommy? I am Dr. Lantern Steins's daughter. Yay! <laughs> Morning, mommy. Because yes. I know she's probably watching you know, because I know she is. feels very proud of you. She wake journey. up early, early. <laughs> <laughs> So the music industry now, how did yes. that come into shape? You know, you're moving away from, well, not moving away, but combining, I'll say combining. combining. Yeah, dancing That's with music, yeah. Perfect, perfect thing you said, yeah. because when you dance, you are so connected to music. Music drives the actual dance, yeah. what you're doing. And I grew up dancing all my life. So that means the music has been there all my life. 13, I said, let me write a thing. And from then, I just kept writing. Wow. And I loved it so much that uh, at the point where I got my injury is when I said, you know what? I loved this before. God gave me another gift, so let me pursue it. All right, so now go drop injury and leave it there. So, aye, I aye. mean, you know how Jamaicans are fast. So I want to know what it was. If you are able to talk about it, of course. Of course. Yeah. So I... I also have rheumatoid arthritis as really? well. Okay. Yes, so fun fact. <laughs> but, uh, you know, things did not go on. You're an art, you're a dancer, an athlete. And I had an injury in the knee. And I had to do surgery and fix it up. And they said, you know, you might walk. We don't know if you're going to dance again. Whoa. So that's where I was in life. But, but darling, you are pretty, like, this is an admirable <laughs> accomplishment, though, for you. Because for you to be going through that, mm -hmm. and it's not something that I know that you kind of grow out of. Do you actually grow out of? Um, not that I know of. No, yeah. <laughs> so it's something that you're living with, I right? Am, and yeah. you're still performing. I, well, if you watch your videos online, if you watch your videos on YouTube, you're still dancing. I can't stop dancing. You can't stop dancing. <laughs> you can't but the vocals now, how did you figure out that, yes, I do have some vocals within me? You know, at first... I try that thing in the bathroom. Everybody tries that thing in the bathroom. You know, you go in the bathroom, you look in the mirror, and you think you're Beyonce. <laughs> um, but you just needed the right people to tell you you're not, or maybe you can be something. Maybe not, you know? So I had really great people around me, and I was honest. And I said, you know, I want to the music, listen to me, and let me know what direction I should go. Yeah, yeah, mm -hmm. yeah. So I'm a piano, what is that? What is I'm a piano? So I'm a piano is a South African genre mm -hmm. that uh, take up the place. You hear it on TikTok all the time, and you don't know it's I'm a piano. You think it's just Afrobeat. Oh, okay. But it's actually a genre within South Africa that fuses jazz, Afrobeat, um, original South African sounds, dance hall, a bunch of things together and make this kind of house vibe music. Nice, yes. nice. So here I am is what we're hearing now. Here I am is what you're hearing. And this is I'm a piano. And this is I'm a piano with a little bit of dance hall. Okay, mm -hmm. okay. So why not reggae? Because you know it's almost like we're expecting that artists from Jamaica to do, should go reggae first. And you know I love that you said that because I've always felt like I needed to do things that people expect. Mm -hmm. But what I want to do is create music that I want me to love yeah you know so i feel like myself i grew up dancing african movement along with traditional along with ballet and other things as well but you know i always felt like there was some kind of african nest to me i guess that's why my mother named me amani yeah and this is what i feel like i should be doing i enjoy doing it no absolutely i love that for you seriously so this song is is not your first single right is it's it your first single? first single okay so I came out with something called I Eyed, which was a little African vibe as well. And that came out when I actually couldn't walk. 
Really? <laughs> so I shot the video before the surgery and then I had lots of other songs after that. Top Girl, No Dibby Dibby with DJ Sunshine, Runkus, um, you know, I did a song with Sparks. Mm -hmm. So I have a couple songs out. Love that. You know, for many persons thinking that your mommy had already a foot in the industry mm -hmm. of entertainment, mm -hmm. they think that, well, Amani's journey is going to be a little bit easier because mommy mm -hmm. has some kind of, you know, entrance already in the industry. The name is not unfamiliar. She's mm -hmm. touched the lives of so many people, That's you know, even influenced Beyonce. So this should be it's a true. walk in the park for <laughs> Amani, right? Has it been that for you at all? How has it been your, I mean, you know, so far for you in the industry? You know, I don't want to say it's been a walk in the park. It hasn't been. Mm -hmm. But I do know a lot of people because of my mother and I'm very grateful for that. Um, and also because of myself, I choreographed a lot of artists before becoming a musician myself. But we mentioned before, you know, as a female artist, they want you to follow the herd, mm -hmm. you know, and I don't want to do that. I yeah. want to make my own thing, and that has been very challenging for me. They see me, they see a dance, and they want me to do controversial things, or cock up your foot, and da 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 da, and sing like this, and sing like that. So I've been trying to really put my foot down and do yeah. things that I want to do. So it's been. I love oh, that so. for you. I love that for you. I love <laughs> that for you. So any albums coming up? Because this is a single and mm -hmm. I know I'm going to pressure you ask if your album and EP and all of these things. Any body of work? To be fair, we're all on this journey together. So oh, we're all going to find this you. out together. <laughs> that for us. But definitely performances are coming yeah. up. You okay, know, good. I get to go on a plane. So I'm excited about that. Love that. So yeah. that's what's coming up. Ultimate goal for you? Ultimate goal for me. What is the ultimate goal? Longevity. You know, to be an artist that Jamaica is proud of. Yeah. You know, I want to be one of them. Like a Sean Paul, like a Shaggy, like a Shensia. You know, I, I must reach there and Jamaica must claim me and say, mm -hmm. You know, say a few way on that. Yeah, yeah. I have one last question for you. Yes. It's about collaboration. Anybody in particular that you'd love to collaborate with right now? Okay, so definitely some I'm a piano artist, you know, maybe Musa Keys, Boule, and definitely Doja Cat because I'm in love with her. So yeah. <laughs> maybe there. No, and we're gonna see her perform later on, guys. She's not leaving us. I can't wait to see you live in action, oh. girl. Bless you. Congrats on everything. <laughs> Thank you, so Thank much. you Stay tuned, guys. More to come right here on Weekend Smile.